What's this? A video? <laughs> Hello, Vanu Von Travia here, and today I'm doing a haul video. That would have been so much better if it focused. <laughs> anyway, uh, so this is different. Uh, not a typical, not a mock video, that's for sure. Um, so. In case any of you were wondering, I was at Brick Fair with Thatch, Okoto, Noretta, and uh, Storm Titan, or Storm Seraph. Uh, I was, I had a blast over there. It was great. And to meet Okoto for the first time in person, it was also fantastic. But, uh, yeah. Um, so, as with every, like, trip to Brick Fair. We bought stuff, so let's get into it, shall we? So, starting off with the pieces, just a bunch of, just a random assortment of junk, system bits, and, well, medium blue stuff, because I, I need it for a certain mock that, uh, you may or may not see a video of soon, assuming I can get my setup properly organized. Uh, some Kordak blasters, you know, why not? I just felt like getting some some LMGs, you know, maybe uh, they'd be useful in some way. Uh, Goras Claws, get back here, alright. Uh, I don't think I actually had these at all, but, you know, they're there. Uh, dark blue hand connectors, also necessary for that certain mock. Yeah, they kind of they kind of look black, just straight up black in the on on camera. But um, if you can see it properly, focus. All right, oh no, focus, please. If they may they may seem just outright black on your end, but I don't know. Uh, I'm not gonna bother trying to fix that. There's nothing I can do. Um, sand blue hand connector. I don't know why. I just Got a few in case uh, Mach needed more sand blue. As you'll notice, a, a recurring theme of just getting a lot of sand blue stuff. Uh, um, some dark, some, my bad, transparent black. Some random bootleg piece. And, well, uh, I covered pretty much everything that was mildly, even mildly interesting. Now let's move over to here, where I have some tan pieces. Toe of stone, maybe? I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, I got some... A lot of medium blue. Lots of it. Um, I have no idea what I'm going to use this for, but I plan to use it. I want to. Some Ben 10 pieces. Like, limb pieces and such. Just random stuff. Uh, even a hand or foot here and there. Um... Like, again, I don't know what I'm going to use these for. I just have them on hand in case I need them. Uh, but uh, I got a Coley stick. Don't have a Coley ball. If you can call it one, that is. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have over here. The Torin Torso. I don't know. I, I, I wanted to get some rare pieces, so... Yeah. Um, Exoforce arms. Those are always useful. It's like on that one Scarabax pieces for like Scarabax creature from the Lego Pharaoh sets and whatever. Uh, all right, so on to like the accessories and the smaller stuff. Uh, Nerda gave me some Kordak blasters or Kordak blaster ammunition rather, and a, a squid. Thank you. I kind of needed that. <laughs> um, some Krana from the mask packs. Uh, focus, 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 focus. That, that's not, that's not in focus. Come on, I know you can do it. You don't screw it. Uh, yeah, just some random stuff. I don't know if you can see this one all too well. Let me just do that. I don't know the names for any of these Krana, just so you know. Uh, I, I don't know what I'm going to use them for either. I just, I just you know, have them on hand. Um, got Modalt to paint this mask for a certain mock you'll see. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, there's a lot of I don't know here. <laughs> um, 
I got Antroz's mask. Didn't have it, so I wanted it. And anything that I have here is mostly something I don't have. This I have, I just sharpied it horribly. It's that one dismantled mock hydrant or whatever. I don't know. It was a bad one. Uh, Toometru Matao's Mahiki. It's kind of dark. It's kind of hard to see. I do apologize. Um, a transparent black cow cow, which is what the the transparent black stuff was for. Hoping to put this to use at some point. And right here, right here, the infected how. I'm not really familiar with the specific patterns that these come in, but it doesn't really matter to me. It's an infected how all the same. Uh, some stuff from the um, from the Kanohi collections. Uh, don't know if I'll put the uh, gold ones to use. The, the silver ones I know for sure because they're closer to like gunmetal and silver. So I'm probably going to put those to use. Uh, I got Dekar solely for the mask. Maybe the Keto Orange pieces will be put to use, but uh, I'm not entirely sure, but he's there. Um, got four of the Toamata. Pretty nice. Got, uh, I think I got Pahatu and Gali for $2 each from, uh, from Steve Squid. Thank you again. He, you know, he just came up to us and uh, offered us to buy some of these, so, yeah, uh, you're a cool dude, thanks very much, if you're watching this video, that is, um, and Carlos fell, nice, uh, Kopaka and Liwa, um, Kopaka I, was, like, the first one I got since I came here, solely because Kopaka is my favorite Toa Vice, or my favorite Toa in general, um, Liwa I got before leaving the convention, and, uh, yeah, that's it for the Toamata. I'm just gonna... There we go. <laughs> um, got this piece of crap right here. Vizola, the stalker lady herself, from, uh, the first... 2000, the first book in the 2004 story. I got her mostly because of the feet, because they're in dark blue, and I need that for a mock as well. Uh, the mask I might put to use, but as for the entire set itself, it's just kind of... Um, and then I got this dragon set, uh, shortly after the convention was over, or not shortly, maybe a few days after the convention was over, because there were some things that, uh, I didn't come to Virginia solely for the convention, I came there to see some old friends and everything, so, um, I stayed there way longer than everyone else did, but, yeah, I got this set at a, at the, at a mall in Crystal City, uh, pretty nice set, I'm thinking of using those helicopter blades for something, I mean, they're swords, and, like, I always have these in gold, I cannot stop getting these in gold, there are just so many of these in gold. So having them in either gunmetal or silver, I'm not too sure. By the box art, it looks like it's gunmetal, but it could be anything at this point. Um, I'm really excited to put these to use because, well, katanas are something I don't really like to make all too often, like as swords and weapons or anything, solely because if I wanted to use that piece, it'd have to be in gold every time. So I'm glad that I have these now so I can, you know, have more realistic looking, you know, katanas and everything. Some more bionic ninjas and whatever. The dragon I don't think I'm going to take apart anytime soon. 
solely because of just how cool it looks and just the overall head design. It's just so sick. All of these are system parts. None of them pre-made. All of this is system. And it looks so, so sleek. It just looks that good. The lower jaw is my only complaint, but it still looks awesome. But, uh, yeah. Um, and among the last things that I got, um, this was right on the day that I came back. I was greeted by, um, which at the time of this recording was technically today. I got home at like one. So, you know, it was pretty late when I got back. Um, but for the next few hours that I slept and woke up, um, I was greeted with this um, Lego magazine. Uh, it's pretty cool. It shows some stuff that I've already seen and you know, some Ninjago sets that I didn't even see on shelves, ones that I actually want to buy solely for the parts. I mean, everything's a parts pack with me, you know. But, uh, yeah, it was pretty cool to be greeted by this thing uh, when I got back. So, yeah, that's the thing. And then while I was at the convention, I, Storm Seraph was there, and he gave me this. I hate you. But in all seriousness, you're awesome because I've won many arguments with this solely just because of how much I would make people laugh by wearing it. But this thing was so stupid. I I have no idea who in the world other than you would would do this to me. But I thank you for it because it's a, it's a very memorable. Hat. I'm not going to put it on because, well, I'm self-conscious, so I'm not going to do it. But, uh... Yeah. So, that's, uh, that's the whole video. Thank you all for watching, and, uh, let me know if you want me to do more vlog-esque stuff like this, because I've been having a huge drought in content, as you may have already noticed. Um... I guess... I might, well, I can't make any promises. I don't even know if I'll have the time to do it. But, um, I may make a video or, or a heads up video, um, for like a gaming channel where I'm going to post all my streams now. Uh, it's, it links in the description. Um, I know I sound like a sellout, but it just it just makes the channel a bit more clean if i have a separate channel for the gaming stuff and you know the the mock stuff stay on the original channel but uh yeah thank you all for watching and i will see you all next time peace